Russian Muslims have come together to commemorate the Holy Eid al-Fitr amidst a backdrop of heightened tensions following a recent terror attack at the concert hall in Moscow. Chairman of the Russian Council of Muftis, Ravel Gainutin, stressed unity, emphasizing that Muslims and Russia stand in solidarity against terrorism. This sentiment was echoed by attendees, including migrants from Central Asia. As our country's president, Vladimir Vladimirovich Putin said, terrorism has neither nationality nor religion, and we call on all of us to unite against the threat against those dark forces that want to destroy our friendship with the Islamic world. The attack at a Moscow concert hall on March 22nd, carried out by suspects predominantly from Tajikistan, has sparked anti-migrant sentiments within Russia. Terrorists, murderers, non-humans who do not and cannot have a nationality face one unenviable fate, retribution and oblivion. They have no future. Despite President Vladimir Putin's assertion that terrorism knows no nationality or religion, there are calls from some quarters to restrict immigration. The economic importance of migrant workers in Russia, particularly from Central Asian nations like Tajikistan, is profound. The Russian economy heavily relies on their labor. In response to the attack, Russian security agencies have detained suspects and intensified migrant controls underscoring the delicate balance between security concerns and economic dependence.